Hello customers and welcome to today's guided walkthrough of a 2016 Mitsubishi Mirage. My name's Jesse, I'm a Perth marriage celebrant and spokesperson for CarPlace here on the corner of Leach Highway and North Lake Road. We hope you enjoy our tour, let's get stuck into it. We're going to start our tour off with a front on view while I list off the car's key features. Packed inside we have 8 airbags, ABS brakes, 2 speaker stereo sound system, central locking, power windows, Bluetooth connectivity, fingers crossed we can cover the remaining features on this vehicle in the short amount of time that we have and I'm sure we will as this, as what we've just inspected, it's a very humble car. Perfect for someone who's recently got their license or perhaps someone on the other end of life who's looking to retire and doesn't need a car with all the salt and pepper, all the bells and whistles, all right? So starting off, we're gonna talk about presentation, beautiful. The detailing team here at this yard do an absolutely immaculate job with the presentation of these cars. A bit of dust about the place here and there, so let's not get too picky, but I will tell you that upon purchase, they're gonna have this car looking like a 2021 model. If you think it looks good now, just wait until then. Okay, features guys, presentation is a feature in itself. We've got a chrome finish, crystal clear headlights, finance options we'll talk about later, and a chrome finish down the bottom as well. Okay, let's take you now down the left-hand side of the vehicle, and we're gonna zoom in first on your steel wheels with the plastic cover along the top. The great thing about these plastic covers, if you're not a fan of how they look, they're very cheap to replace, so you might be able to go to the car store and be able to get them swapped over for something that's more your style. Next up, we do have your side mirror with a plastic guard beneath. It has copped something, a little bit of a bump, and I reckon that's gonna come out with a little bit of polish, mind you. Uh, electronically adjustable, matching paint job. Let's continue along. Uh, once again guys, very minor blemishes on the paint job, so minor, they're probably going to come out with the polish, like I said, just wait for the detailing team to get to it a bit later. Alright, back left hand tyre, ABS brakes are installed in the car guys, your car won't, uh, well, heavily reducing the chance that it's going to slip about the road if you're in an emergency braking scenario. Fuel caps on the left hand side, was just testing if it's push open, no, you've got the trigger inside your car. Okay, snail eye antenna, water jet here to partner up with your back windscreen wiper to clean that off, you've got the demisting strips uh, installed as well. Chrome finishes about the place, warranty we'll talk about a little bit later, and just once again, just very minor imperfections about the place. Alrighty, let's suss out your boot space. Enough of it for your groceries, your knickknacks, your luggage to the airport, okay? If you lift up the floor, we've got a, a spare tire with a toolkit in there to be able to swap that over. Let's get rid of that little bit of rubbish for you. Okay, we do also have a cargo tray along the top. It is only held on by one of the straps. Unfortunately, the one on the right-hand side here has come away. Um, maybe we might be able to get that replaced for you, but don't quote me on it. Simply follow up with your car salesperson. Okie doke, let's continue around the right hand side. We'll start off by zooming in on our back right hand wheel. All the, um, all the wheels so far have been in pretty good condition in regards to presentation. Okay, we have a leather interior, my friends. Power windows. Okay, jumping inside, and it's a very humble interior, my friends. We've got carpet floor mats at the feet, and the, the seats themselves are made from the couch cloth material. Super comfy, they get the job done. Okay, time now to take you through the front. Leather interior, we've got uh, your power windows and your window locks. Jumping up inside, your toggle pad for your side mirror adjustments, and traction control if you're stuck in sand. All right, we've got a leather-bound steering wheel, power steering to your left-hand side. There are some volume station and uh, uh, what, phone controls there? Voice controls, I should say. Okay, taking you through the center. We have a leather dashboard along the top. You've got a phone holder already available for you to uh, plug in your phone there. Um, cool, continuing down, CD player, bit of an old school. Uh, stereo system here, you do have an aux input to your right hand side. The old school air conditioning controls, continuing down we've got a 12 volt power supply here, equip any accessories, storage, drink holders, leather gear stick, leather park brake and a, a drink holder down here as well. Moving over to your glove box, popping this down we've got a Mitsubishi wallet inside your wallet, the service history and the owner's manual for the Mitsubishi Mirage, tucked away in there, ever so nicely. Let me rest that under there, it doesn't go flying about the place. Let's find the service histories 
First service looks like it was 2017 at 1,774 kilometres. Someone needs to work on their handwriting. 2018, 2019, 2019, 2020, November at 60,000 kilometres, my friends. Okay, that's that. Let me put this back in its home and continue our tour. We've got some storage right above your glove box here for your passenger. Airbag right here, airbag up here by my head. Grab handle. The licensing and registration lasts to the 31st of August this year. I know that's not life changing, but it's a little added bonus. A couple of months of included registration. We've got a sun visor, massive, can barely see out the windscreen. Lift this up and we've got a mirror. Anti-glare rear view mirror, just make that adjustment if someone has bright headlights behind you. Your light controls, done. Done, my friends. Let's leave this back up there. I'll remind you of your couch seats, your carpet floor mats, and you do also have storage in the door for a drink bottle and uh, anything else you might wanna, wanna put in there. Okay, time for us to pop your hood and finish off the right hand tour. Once again, guys, some very minor imperfections about the place. And I, I've said it plenty of times already, hopefully most of them can come out with a splash of polish. All right, now suss out your last wheel. I know that one there isn't as presentable as the remaining three. And time to check out your hood space, guys. You're gonna have to forgive the little bit of dust. As I said before, guys, just wait for the detailing team to get to this upon purchase, and they're gonna spruce everything up. Soundproofing board along the top as well to collect a lot of noise. Forgive the dust, and we hope that's, you can see if you're a rev head and you know your engine bays that all the parts are in its right places and uh, so on and so forth. Okay, let's drop this down and wrap up our video. Thanks so much for watching, guys. We hope you found it entertaining, but most importantly, we hope you found it informational, okay? Informative, I should say. Three things to tell you as we wrap up. Warranty is available on the car. Get the warranty, guys. Give yourself some peace of mind and spare yourself any potential headaches. Secondly, same day finance approval is offered here at the yard. Our finance team are masters at what they do. They just get the finance sorted out with the banks efficiently, quickly, promptly, you name it, they, they just got it handled. Lastly, if you think the Mirage might be for you, book in a test drive, take it down Leach Highway and back, see how you feel afterwards, take things from there. Thanks so much for watching my friends, have a wonderful day and we'll hear from you soon.